Every 1st February is celebrated as World Hijab Day. It is a world solidarity event meant to create awareness and better understanding of the concept of hijab. The day is currently celebrated in more than 140 countries worldwide. In recognition of World Hijab Day, Federation of Muslim Women's Association in Nigeria, Form 1, Adamawa State Chapter, organized a program to emphasize the importance of hijab in Islam, which is very fundamental in the life of a Muslim woman. The Amira Form 1, Kaltum Abdullahi Abari, urged Muslim women to drop the ideology of modern dressing and embrace the wearing of hijab. A woman is supposed to cover herself whilst she's living her house. Or any visitor that coming into her house should, should not see uh, the kind of dress she wears so that she cover, she will put her hijab in order to protect herself from being seen. Officials representing various Islamic organizations, women and students from different government and private schools attended the event. They were lectured on the importance of the day and its significance to the Muslim woman. Some of the women who attended the event also bear their minds on the day. It's a program that has started for a very long time. It's now celebrated all over. And it's an, a program to enlighten the people because covering has been um, advocated since the time of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So it's just a continuation of what has been done before. Hijab is not a fashion. Wear it modestly. Wear a long, nice hijab. Don't put half hijab because it's fashion, as we said. Because Islam teaches that every woman must cover their whole body, that's the entire body with the exception of the hands and the face. So this day reminds every believer about it. Though they are celebrating it just to remind others because it has been there. It is very nice because I see the majority of people have put their full hijab. Because if you see them at the street, they are not putting it. But because of this special day, they put their hijab fully from up to down. Sam Amodeda, 2-6 News.